couple of really important muscles when it comes to treating ITB that get missed a lot, and I want to introduce these to you. <clears throat> Number one, the first one is the short head of biceps fem. So you can see I've removed the long head of the biceps here. We're looking at this part here, this muscle here. Now, there is a couple of really, really cracking trigger points in here. You'll need to push biceps fem out of the way and obviously sink into that short head, which is a little bit more lateral, but it refers beautifully into that ITB area, especially where that pain starts to, to develop. Now, it's, it's important that when you are addressing these trigger points that you actually hit the area properly because the, the biceps fam itself is obviously a big bulky muscle. So in order to get to the short head, you actually need to almost push it into a medial position then sink into it. And I'll show you that as we go through some of the treatment sequences. Now also we have, we've got the sciatic nerve that comes down here and it's branches as well. We've obviously got the one that wraps around here into the, the perineal area. This is a really common site for nerve entrapments, for peripheral nerve entrapment. So this is another really gem of an area to be aware of. And also it sometimes plays a role in also mimicking ITB pain. So it's once again, it's another area that we need to address in terms of dealing with potential mimickers. <clears throat> now, if we come down, we're gonna turn around and we're gonna see we've got the quadricep muscles here. So we've got vastus lateralis, this big muscle on the outside of our quad and the ITB pretty well much lies right on top of it. So we're gonna be looking at three trigger points here into the vastus lateralis and then there's another one at the back and another one just below the greater trachea. So we're gonna be looking at addressing those, needling those in specifically. And then you've got a cluster of trigger points in and around the lateral part of the knee. So there's four in total. So that's another really common area that we're gonna be looking at in terms of our treatment sequences. The rest of it is going to be up in this gluteal area. Okay, so it's important that we're going to be dealing probably with the big prime movers. So we're going to be working with that glute max, we're certainly going to be working with the glute minimus and the medius as well. So those trigger points lie up over here in the iliac crest. So anyway, these are part of the areas that we're going to be trying to break apart for you, give you some understanding. We're going to use a couple of different modalities. We're going to use obviously the dry needling. We're going to hit you up with some vacuum cupping. We're going to do some soft tissue work and then finish off with some taping. So let's go for it.